Ice Road in America. I'm with my best friend singer, LA's number one food blogger. Who knows what kind of good food and great drinks we're gonna crush. I'm so excited to be going on this foodie venture with my buddy Adam. We're gonna be on Highway 50 going towards Nevada's cowboy country. We'll be trying a bunch of restaurants and having a few drinks here and there. Anyways, we gotta go. Where's Adam? Adam, we gotta go. Singer, what's the first stop? First stop's gonna be Bray's Distillery, and they're known for their sagebrush gin. We're in Fallon, about an hour outside of Reno, and this place is the epitome of grain to glass. They grow, irrigate, harvest, mill, distill, age, and bottle all of their spirits here. This gin has the sage in there and then Rocky Mountain junipers, which are both native here in Nevada. And um, I always like to tell everybody, it tastes like Nevada smells right after a rainstorm. I want to taste Nevada. Me too. Cheers. Mm. It smells good. Cheers. You know, this doesn't have the same, like, bite usually, you know, gin's have. This one's very That's sweet awesome. and smooth. Yeah. yeah. Welcome to Middle Gate Station. It's home of the former Pony Express and the Monster Burger Challenge. Ooh. Ready? Let's go. This homey and historic dive has all the fixings needed to post up for a bit. And the Monster Burger Challenge is a quick draw to road trippers like us. This monster is over a pound of lean meat topped with lettuce, tomato, red onions, pickles, and cheese, all on a homemade sourdough bun. This is a monster burger challenge. If we finish this, we get a free t-shirt. Oh, it's on. Don't disappoint me. No, oh, you're a messy eater. You're like an animal. I can't take you anywhere. One I need a minute. more I need a minute. bite. <laughs> 20 calories down, only 4,980 to go. We're in Kingston, a small town off Highway 50, and we're going to have a drink named after an epic mountain here. This drink has a tobacco sea salt rim with a perfect blend of horseradish and fresh tomato juice. To top it off, pickled vegetables. This is the Bunker Hill Bloody Mary. This is what this place is known for. Cheers! Cheers. <laughs> it's spicy, just how I like my women. This region is also known as Basque Country. Sheep herders from Spain migrated here and brought with them their home style recipes. In downtown Ely, the chorizo burger at Rax is the perfect blend between traditional Basque flavors and local ingredients. We love the pretzel bun. Just down the street from Rax, you can eat inside a jail cell, a foodie must. I love cheesecake. Being from New York, this is one of the most famous desserts there. And this one is amazing. Yeah, the irony is bittersweet, but the history is delicious. Adam, last stop, place called Kerouac's. Aw, Tinger, how poetic. The owners are from Brooklyn, and we get to try some of their pizzas. So why Baker? How did you end up here? We wanted to go camping, but instead we ended up staying at this motel and it ended up being Destiny because it was for sale um, along with the restaurant. Everything just felt right. There was a really good vibe in this town. We named the restaurant Kerouac's. Everyone who comes here is on the road. Everyone's on a road trip. They're coming to the National Park or passing through. So what pizza do you recommend here? The margarita is just your classic featuring um, Italian tomatoes, uh, fresh mozzarella, and fresh basil. This road trip has been beyond belief. The rustic towns, the hearty food, that pizza, one of the best I've ever had. Getting out of Los Angeles and into Nevada has been so surreal. The food has been hashtag worth it. Road tripping with Tinger has been an absolute blast. Tinger, get over here. Tinger, this was a tasty road trip. One for the books. As they say, time to hit the dusty trail. 